hippos are huge. Yes, they are. Hippos are huge, except for elephants. No other land animals are as large as hippopotamuses. They can weigh as much as 50 men. Wow. A hippo has the biggest mouth of any animal, except for a whale. Watch out, hippo's yawn is a threat. It means stay away. Which do you think is most dangerous animal in Africa? A lion, a crocodile? No. Would you believe that the hippo is the most dangerous animal in Africa? With, its mon with their monstrous jaws and razor sharp tusks, hippos can bite a giant crocodile in half or chomp a small boat in two. And they are fast. They can run faster than a human and they can travel faster in water too. Hippos don't really swim. Look, first hippo dives with their ears pressed against their head and their nostrils closed. Next, she bounces gracefully along the bottom, kicking off with her hind legs and glides, then dances on her tiptoes and kicks off again. Hippos burst through the surface, spouting fountains of water from her nostrils. When Hippo isn't dancing along the water or chasing crocodiles, she spends most of the day with just her eyes, ears, and nose sticking out of the water, resting and watching. A cattle egret picks its dinner of insects from the hippo's ears. A fish nips tidbits of food stuck between hippo's teeth. Yum. Oh, oh my gosh, what's going on here? Just then, a, just then, a great commotion erupts and hippo watches as two bulls square off. The two bulls turn and stand rump to rump and they swing their tails like baseball bats and swap balls of dung at each other. Splat, splat. It's a smelly message. Keep out. Yuck. When this doesn't work, the defending bull yawns to show off his powerful tusks and then pounces with a great roar and attacks with giant jaws. Hippo watches as they honk and snort until finally the defeated bull limps away. Man, that would be scary to see. In the nearby nursery, Hippo watches baby Hippo playing. Two calves play fight in a Hippo tug of war with their jaws locked together. Soon it will be Hippo's turn to mate and in a few months, she'll have a baby of her own. Months pass, the rain came and fill the lakes and rivers. And now it's time. Hippo stands neck deep in water and a baby is born. Baby Hippo paddles to the surface and his head pops up for his first breath. Then he dives back down and nudges Hippo's teeth for her milk. A few weeks later, Hippo and her calf join the nursery and wallow in the mud. They snuggle together and gently lick and nuzzle each other. Though baby Hippo looks tiny next to his mother, when he's six months old, he's, he will weigh 500 pounds. Hippos are huge.